red sitting in what? the D as well as another bonus. Yeah, you can do. Sit and watch and hope he gets another visit to the table in this year's championship. And then he'll be trying like mad to make sure this is the last chance he needs to win the championship. Seven. Eight. No need to be even contemplating getting the black back in play. No need whatsoever. I mean, these balls are spread. These are pretty good for the pink. It's available in at least three of the pockets of the top four there you can see Hit. this is a series of screws and stuns like a little practice routine you do in the club 40. just a matter of holding yourself together he's done this thousands upon thousands of times in practice Stephen just sitting, waiting, and hoping. Twenty-one. Problem for Stephen, of course. It's, it's one of those chances that it's the chance you want, isn't it? Pink goes in both corners, blue waiting, red and ball. Is it an out ball? Yeah, there's a lot of get outs, even if you lose the cue ball, and you know the thing doesn't do that very often. 28. So far, exemplary with the cue ball. Just check in there just to leave an angle. Pop the pink in the middle. Stun down for the red. Oh, it's just below the white currently. Two. Forty seven ahead. Let's have a little calculation then. Three reds and three colours will be enough for a third United Kingdom championship. Yep, yeah, of the four reds that he's closest to, three of them are definitely possible. Forty nine. How well has he taken these so far?
Still on a sixpence, this cue ball. Right the way through the break. Even that perfect 56. angle for the pink, that's done. One you can let the cue ball run away with or come up short. Perfect it is. Yeah, almost there, pink for 61. Just the pink and the red. Everyone in the barbecue 62. knows that this is going to be the final nail. And what a response you have to say this is, Alan, from the onslaught of Stephen Maguire, consecutive centuries, getting himself back to 8-6, the last two frames, Dingy and Wade, okay, had a little bit of luck getting on the pink in the last frame, but to make the century, and this has just been wonderful, chance was shown to him, he's taken it. Yeah, he took out Ronnie O'Sullivan in the last 16, on his birthday no less. Injun Wee, 32 years of age, born on April the 1st. But he ain't no fool, this fella. <laughs> well beyond it. The winning post now, it's just a lap 55. of honour. That's where he should be. He's been an absolutely wonderful player for a long time. Fair to say, the last couple of seasons he's gone missing. Talk about him losing his appetite for the sport. Well, he's certainly got it back now. And back where he should 81. be, winning major championships. It's great to have him back on the circuit playing as well as this. He's been missed. 82. And when he plays like this, he is a match for anybody. Only fitting in a match of this quality that Ding should finish with a century. Come on, Ding. This is the way to win a major championship. 94. Ninety-six. Ninety-nine. Wait for the applause then. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. Simply wonderful. He hasn't finished his break, and there's people on their feet in the audience. They're standing up already. How good they've seen this session. That has been wonderful speaker. Performance for the edges there, and the Ding Jun Hui is crowned. It may be the end of a decade, but that signals a new beginning for Ding Jun Hui. He will roar into the 20s as the Betway United Kingdom snooker champion.